great. Is everything okay? I gave my report to the Admiral. Apparently, some of the crew have called for me to be stripped of rank and cast out. I'm so sorry, Seika. That must be really hard to take. It doesn't matter. Where are we headed next? Well, um, we know where Laundra sent the data from his old company. Somewhere on the mainland, north of where we met. Should be able to fly there. Yeah, about that. Let's take my skiff this time instead. Not a fan of flying, huh? I'm a marine. I'll take the water over the skies any day. All right, I'll take your skiff. Should we get going? Yeah, let's go. Follow me. <sighs> nice and easy. And, unlike flying, if you fall off, you don't die. Open water ahead, and fleet's end disappearing behind us, along with everyone in it. Why do you put up with them? I mean, I, I get what it's like to feel as if an entire tribe's against you. I would have stormed out of there a long time ago. It wasn't always like this. I was a good Marine. A good sister. It felt like I belonged. That belonging is a kind of strength. One that keeps me going even in the roughest seas. When you have something like that, you can't cast it aside. I see. You know, your people don't know how lucky they are to have you. I don't know about that. I do. Well, seems like the coordinates are leading us towards that horse. That thing gives me the creeps. On clear nights, we can see it from the camp looming over us. There! On the shore! More of our boats! Then we're on the right track. I'll take us in! its point to somewhere up the hill. After you. Definitely seems like we're heading for the Metal Devil. Why would Laundra send his data here? I'm not sure. It's not a place to bring a bunch of Quen to. I just hope we find them. My people were here, all right. Looks like they headed further up the hill. The coordinates lead that way, too. Andra must have set it up. Doesn't look like there's a way past it. There's some kind of device on the other side. I think I can scan it. All right. Let's see what's on this thing. It looks like there's something further in. Some kind of compound. Laundra might be in there. You're missing people, too. 
I'm not seeing a way past the barrier. There. It's some kind of power generator. Hooked up to the arm of the Horus. Laundress figured out how to get part of it working again. A metal devil can't actually wake up, can it? I'm not sure. But at least right now, it must be how Laundra's powering the barrier. So if we can find a way to shut down those generators, it should come down. It's worth a shot, at least. It looks like there are two of them nearby. Come on, let's get going. The generators should be back down the hill. Trouble to power that shield. Got a couple of our big ugly friends, too. Ugh, and more eggs. Just follow my lead. See if we can shut this thing down. We gotta hurry. Some kind of power core. I can't hit the core on my own. Seika, I need you to shoot the core. How about we finish this fight first? Now for the other generator. Oh! 
Barrier should be gone now. Ancestors, I hope my people are in there. You know, the last time I saw my sister, I was relieved she was leaving for a scouting mission. I guess I wanted a break from her. I get it. Things aren't always easy with my sister, either. I thought you said you were an outcast. I only met her recently. It's a... It's a long story. Always full of surprises, huh? I try. Point is, I'm... I'm sure your sister will be glad to see you. I don't know. But it's nice of you to say. You come to Wait. join us? Join you? Yeah, we have. It took a while, but we finally made it. <laughs> a barbarian, one of the chosen. Impossible. Zath would never allow this. Hmm. How did you get in without him? Well, Zeth sent us, actually. After we helped him out of that, um, that ambush in the wilds. Right! You see, I was on my way here with him when machines attacked us. We tried to hold them off, but we were outnumbered. That's when Aloy here came to the rescue. I was exploring the region when I ran across them, so I just rushed in to help. <laughs> you should have seen her. One of the best machine hunters I've ever met. She saved Zeth's life. Oh, I was just doing what I could. <laughs> Zeth had something important he needed to take care of after, so he said to go on without him. And that's when he told us how to lower the barrier and said we should head straight inside. Zeth really needed a barbarian to get him out of trouble. We all need a little supporting fire every now and then. Well, Zeth gave them the okay. And I am not risking one of his outbursts. Let the others inside know about our new arrivals, will you? Fine, but I'm not letting them into the Ascension Hall until they prove they're devoted, just like everyone else. And I'll be interested to hear Zeth's side of this when he returns. Oh, by all means. Don't mind him. Good luck in there, Seika. May you both embrace his light. I can't believe my people are here willingly. And the answer to Zeth. Yeah, he sounds like a great guy. Let's get to this ascension hall before you have a hologram of Wandra. Welcome, my chosen. You have wandered, you have suffered, but you are lost no more. For I have found you, and I offer you what you deserve. The ascension. So be at ease, forget what you think you know, and embrace this moment. A new world awaits. Okay. Oh, that's a lot of Wandra. So he wants us to embrace his oh, good. light. This guy again. Literally. Well, if it isn't our do-gooder. 
and the Barbarian. It all makes sense now. The time of ashes, the floods in the Great Delta. We've been trapped in a cycle of destruction, but soon we'll have a new world. That's quite a promise. And now that you've proved your devotion, you're ready for what comes next. Zeth will lead you there as soon as he returns. Not so fast. Your good deed in the wilds may have gotten you this far, but you'll get no special treatment here. Walter himself granted me the privilege of guarding the Ascension Hall. So until you complete your review and learn the words of attainment, this door remains shut. No exceptions. Okay, okay, we will be back later then. Sounds like we're supposed to pass some kind of laundry devotion test. But who knows how long we have before this Seth guy gets back. There's gotta be a faster way to learn whatever the words of attainment are. Let's take a look around. Maybe someone will be willing to help us out. We should see what Laundra's been telling them then. Ah, you must be the ones Brennick mentioned. Two more souls chosen to leave our thankless old life behind. Yes, that is us. It's Kiral, right? You were stationed on the Spark? In my former life, yes. Just one more Marine bound to a hopeless expedition. Ugh. Enough of that. Hmm? As Walter says, we must forget the past. Our suffering led us here, after all. And now... The Ascension is almost upon us. This place is such a wonder, isn't it? I've never seen anything like it. Oh, but it is still nothing compared to what's in the Ascension Hall. You've been inside? Indeed. I proved my devotion not long before you joined us. Now I wait to be taken to what lies ahead. One step closer to the Ascension. Look, Kirol, we need your help. You said that the Ascension is almost here. Seika and I are trying to prove our devotion as fast as we can. But we're running out of time. We need to get into the Ascension Hall. But, but the only way to learn the words of attainment is to pass your devotion review. Unless you help us out. We're a lot like you. We've suffered so much until now. Storms, shipwrecks, hunter killer machines. We don't want to go back to that. Well, we should all embrace his light. Perhaps even with a helping hand. Okay. It's kind of what Walter said when he sat with us and told us his story about where eternity lies. It's on a new world, right? As part of the Ascension? Exactly. You understand him so well. But... I don't know. I... I really shouldn't be breaking protocol. Please, Karal. We don't want to live in a world without Walter. Okay, I'll tell you. Only through devotion may I embrace his light. Only through him... May I ascend to a new world? Thanks. We owe you one. I'm glad to have helped. May you embrace his light. Well, we got our words of attainment. Renick should let us into the Ascension Hall now. I already Let's told get you. Out of here. No one's getting past me without the words of attainment. Oh, we know the words. Seika. Oh, no. You should have the honor, Aloy. Only through devotion 
May I embrace his light only through him. May I ascend to a new world. No one's ever passed their devotion review so quickly. Well, we did, so will you get out of the way now? I don't know how much more of Laundra I can take. Yeah, let's see what he's really up to. All this time, I didn't even want to be found. We don't know if they all feel that way. Yeah. Sure. Something on your mind? Nothing. The Ascension Hall better have answers. That's all. An elevator. Let's see where it leads. Pancha's really building up the suspense. Must be quite a spectacle up there. The ancestors. That's how they'll ascend. I'm just building a spaceship, all right. We better take a closer look. Clouds. They're not real. It's all an illusion. It's a, a warning, I think. For radiation. Something toxic. It should be safe enough for now, but I'd better check out the ship. Okay. Tell me what you find. Storage. Just followers? But that can't be enough space for all of them. And MSP again. What does that mean? The rocket. The source of the radiation. That's why he grabbed data from that old prototype in his headquarters. It must be how he'll get the lift he needs. Just got the Horus's printer working again. To build the ship. I have seen enough. I don't like that look. What did you find? The Horus. It has a... a special component. One that can make almost anything you can imagine. Parts, tools, even entire machines. Londra has rigged it to build what he needs for his ship. But in order for the ship to leave, it needs a ton of power. Way more than what Laundra could achieve with what he had. So he went looking for something from his old company. Exactly. Part of the data he got was for a blueprint. For a kind of... boost. One that's as toxic as it gets. If this ship gets airborne... It'll spread a poison from here to every tribal land in the region. Everyone will get sick and die. There's still something I don't get. Why would Landra do all of this just to get off this world? Oh, This again! Sake. You're still not telling me everything! My people are the ones that are caught up in all this! My sister! I deserve to know. You're right. I will tell you, it just won't be. Guess our time's up. Blind filth! Oh, this must be our friend Zeth. Spread out. Reinforcements will follow. Time to put you down! Never seen a cannon like that before. I guess Londra gave him a new toy. <laughs> Get out of here! Zeth's got this whole place on lockdown. But maybe there's a way to shut it off. Survive and look for something to override. Keep going! Stop! You're no match for my Stop! It doesn't have to be this I don't think they're listening, Seika! Ugh! 
I've waited for this! Uh. Oh. I'm just starting with you! Oh. the lockdown. A bunch with the lockdown. Now it ends. Come for me, then. I see you, You won't make it. Uh. Oh. The weak have fallen! Lockdown's lifted. Now to get to Zeth. Don't let them through! Your fear is understandable! I knew some of those Marines. You didn't even hesitate to attack. Yeah, there's something off about them. But for now, we focus on Zeth. Right. Come on out, Zeth. Let's get this done. I'll enjoy crushing you both. Nice to meet you, too. You've got some heavy Shut it stuff!
Where have you been taking the rest of our people? <laughs> Answer her question. He takes the devoted to his park on the southern peninsula. But you'll never reach it. The tower there is positioned to ward off any approach. And my sister is there? She was in the final group. I'm not supposed to bring any more over. But Walter promised the ascension to everyone who proves themselves. I don't understand. Londra's been using you to get what he wants. Let's face it, you're an easy mark. Too blinded by your own ego to see the truth. Well, you just slipped his world upside down. Just give me a straight answer. Why does Landra want to leave? <sighs> Something is coming to Earth. It destroyed the world that Landra fled, and it wants to do the same thing here. Destroy the world? What could possibly do that? It's called Nemesis. It's like a machine, sort of. But it's more powerful than anything you or I have ever faced. That's why Landra's building the ship. He's doing everything in his power to leave before it gets here. And I guess he wants to take some Quen with him, too. Look, I know this is a lot to take in, but there's still hope. If you say so. Seika. There's a beach on the southeast coast of the island where we took down the first tower. That's probably the closest we'll get to Landra's park. And I should probably report back to the Admiral. Tell him... something about what we found here. Okay. I'll meet you at the beach then. That was bad. That was, that was really bad. Seika, she seemed so... lost. Why do I feel like that too? How do I fix this? For now, I'd better take a look at that Zenith weapon. I think I can turn this into something I can use. There. I should test it out when I get back outside. Better check on the rest of the Quinn on my way out, too. worse than the others he has. Willing to irradiate thousands so long as he survives. Sick and I have to find a way to stop him once I make things right with her. I guess Brennick spread the word to the rest of the people here that Londra doesn't care about them. They must be pretty confused.
Everyone, please, remain calm. It seems like the Quen have some thinking to do. I hope they figure it out and head back to Fleet's End. But I gotta meet up with Seika. Talk things out with her. Make sure we're okay. Hard to believe all this might just end. Yeah, I feel uh, pretty bad about just dropping that on you. At least you were honest. Because I haven't been honest with you. Those paintings we saw in Laundry's old building. I recognize the style. My sister painted them. She's one of them. One of his followers. I wanted to hide it from you, or hide it from myself, maybe. She's gone. I've lost her. And I feel like I've lost my tribe, too. Now you tell me that the world is ending? What am I supposed to do with all that? Seika. What's the point? Seika, I, I completely understand why you wouldn't tell me that. It's okay. But your sister? Your, your people, they are a part of you. Nothing can change that. You have to fight for them. To save them from Londra, but maybe even to save them from themselves. A and you will. That's just you. That's part of what makes you... Great. You don't have to do it alone, okay? I will help you, I promise. Oh. <laughs> okay. Okay. We, uh, we need to find a way onto that peninsula. The currents are too strong for swimming. Yeah. And if we fly or take your skiff, that tower will knock us out. I was thinking, there's a machine that can fly and dive below the surface. The water wing. I thought you said the towers blasted a bunch of them out of the sky. Yeah. But if we were riding one, maybe we could do better. Time our dives to duck below shots from the tower. Can that spear of yours tame one? No. Not yet, at least. Are there any water wings left? Do you think you could find one? There have been a few sightings since we took down the first tower. I could ask around the settlement. Okay, let me know when you have a lead. In the meantime, I'll work on the override. Gotta admit, I'm not exactly looking forward to the ride. Seika seems better. Good. We're good. Okay. Can't get distracted from the task at hand. Gonna need some support for this one. Hey, Beta? I need your help. Do you think you and Gaia can modify my Sunwing override to work on water wings? Hmm. The two machines do share a lot of similar code. 
We might be able to patch together a software update at the fabrication terminal. But we'll need some data from a water wing's ballast regulator and an intact wing membrane. On it. Guy and I will prep everything here in the meantime. Stay safe. Sega mentioned there used to be water wings near Fleet's End. The Zenith Tower we took down blasted them out of the sky, so I should be able to die for the parts. Ballast regulator. One intact wing. Got what I need. Time to go. Not too much down here. I've got the parts. Sending over the data now. Got it. And... <laughs> Done. Sending the software updates you now. Once you apply it to the override module on your spear, it should work on any water wing you find. Thanks, Beta. Anytime. Good luck out there. I'm gonna need a workbench to apply the update. The workbench. Time to finish the water wing override. There. Seika, any luck finding a water wing? I spotted a flock on the southern tip of the island south of Fleet's End. I'm headed there now. If you need to resupply, now's a good time. Once you get there, we should head out right away. Got it. I'll see you there.